So thank you very much, and uh, let me welcome our distinguished guests uh, from China, uh, from uh, Serbia, and from Croatia as well, uh, and also from Germany. Uh, I think that's the great uh, uh, potential for us uh, to share uh, where we are now, and uh, I would like to call your attention to our uh, services. Uh, CACZ is established uh, to supporting uh, the trade and development in the Central European uh, region, and uh, as an institution, it is supported by the Chinese government. In the following presentation, I'm going to give you a very short introduction of our activities and uh, a list of uh, supporting uh, services we provide uh, for you. As you can see in the picture, uh, our... Uh, sorry. Doesn't work well. So may I ask you to go one step back, one slide back? No. To the opening. Okay. Um, just in one picture, I, would, I can uh, describe to you very briefly uh, the main activities. It means designing and planning of the market entry activities. Then execute via logistics. It means uh, by air, by sea shipment and uh, also by railroad uh, transportation and plus, with difficult to show it in the picture, plus financing activities uh, we can provide uh, for your making the business. Next slide, please. Next, please. Okay, thank you. Uh, the main institution and also the list of the activities you can see it's a special economic uh, zone that's our objective we would like to gather very soon that we expect uh, very soon uh, an audit uh, from the ministry of commerce of china shortly called uh, mafcom and i really hope that uh, we can fully all of the requirements uh, they have planned uh, to enter into the central european market Chinese and Hungarian government uh, supporting the, the activities. It means uh, not only just uh, uh, approve uh, the, the activities, but it means also financially supporting the opening uh, of the uh, activities and also to bring Chinese companies to the Central European region. The next one is uh, uh, we represent uh, Chinese companies here uh, in this uh, building. Uh, they can open their showrooms and they can open uh, their uh, representation office uh, in the building, which is the uh, biggest uh, Chinese trade center in Central Europe. And if the activities uh, have been started here in our building, they can uh, start market entry information to be collected uh, then uh, networking activities uh, to be made uh, with uh, the potential uh, interesting partners and uh, it's a potential also to receiving legal, uh, financial and uh, market information uh, the databases and to collect and then it makes easier the market entry. Trade finance uh, services we provide uh, trade financing uh, to the import activities. So if a Central European company, and I would like to offer now to Vojvodina companies as well uh, this uh, potential, if they would like to import uh, some goods uh, from China, which are traditionally imported by Western companies uh, to Europe, um, and then uh, sold under, uh, under Western brand names uh, to us, uh, then uh, we would be really happy to finance the import uh, activities uh, and provide all the kind of logistic service uh, for that. Currently we are doing it and we are doing it for the goods which are traditionally not made uh, in, uh, in uh, Hungary for example. Hungary is very strong in lighting industry but is not so strong for lead lighting for example. So currently, we are also financing uh, a, light in the, a lighting industry imports uh, from China. And uh, in the coming uh, presentation, you will receive a little bit more information. How and is it uh, successful now? And I think uh, you will convert uh, the, uh, the preparation into a reality and how it really works. 
Also, we do a uh, financing activity for agricultural machinery imported from uh, China and in Central Europe uh, to be sold because nowadays these Chinese goods have a very good quality, but in Hungary we don't have uh, such kind of agricultural machinery manufacturing. Uh, and uh, whole international logistic services, which means that if Chinese goods enter into the European market, they can uh, be uh, stored in our uh, warehouses, which could be a bonded warehouse, it means that a customs warehouse, uh, and then we can uh, deliver it uh, in uh, Central Europe and, if necessary, the whole Europe, and uh, it makes uh, uh, shorten the entry to market. Usually, if we count with one or two months uh, supply uh, from China, it takes very long and sometimes the customers they don't want to wait so long. They don't want and uh, the, the trading company uh, doesn't want to uh, or doesn't able to finance so long uh, the activities. Next slide, please. Hope it's working. Um, Yes, uh, here you can see the, the logistics activities and what uh, Mr. Bugarski said, uh, you can see now in, uh, from north to south, we have a very good connection uh, to, uh, towards to Serbia, but in Hungary, we would say it's uh, the access point of five main uh, corridors of the European Union. That's uh, a very unique uh, position from logistics point of view. So uh, if you are in Hungary, then you are really uh, in the central of Europe and very easy uh, from here uh, to uh, distribute your goods uh, in uh, central Europe. Um, you can see here also a, a big uh, minority in Hungary and the big minority of Chinese people, they can help uh, also uh, to the companies to establish the and uh, going ahead. Next slide, please. Here in the where we are in the building, uh, that's the Budapest uh, China Mart uh, and uh, it will be transformed in the, to the Central European uh, Trade and Logistics Zone headquarters in Europe. Uh, the main activity is that we provide uh, the exhibition services and here we pro provide the services I just mentioned before from finance, from legal point of view, uh, and uh, trade development uh, to provide services not only for the Chinese companies, but also the whole Central European companies if they would like to cooperate uh, with uh, China uh, or if they are looking for some basic information or uh, advanced information about uh, Chinese activities. Next. Uh, here you can find some pictures about uh, our events. Uh, I hope uh, also that the Shandong province uh, will hold a very good uh, event uh, this time because uh, uh, Shandong province has come back uh, already many times uh, to us and that we are glad, very glad uh, to do that. And uh, really we can see that uh, between Shandong and Hungary we still have, we already have a quite um, uh, accelerated uh, business uh, development. Just one example is the investment of the Wanghua uh, Corporation to the Borschotkam uh, plant. It's already exceeding 2.5 billion uh, euro uh, investment, uh, which is uh, really uh, uh, the biggest in the whole Central uh, Europe. And we expect uh, also uh, some other investments uh, and, uh, and uh, provide uh, as kind of support as we, as we can for that. Next slide, please. Um, we opened here in this building the Chinese brand exhibition uh, uh, center. So there are many uh, very famous uh, Chinese brands are represented, which are uh, usually uh, very traditional companies and well known in China. But in Europe, those brands are not well known. I, ju I just give you some examples like uh, Hisense, in Chinese we said uh, Haixin. Uh, the company is the sixth biggest uh, television manufacturer uh, in the world, uh, but uh, we don't know uh, this brand. We should learn uh, this kind of brands because, okay, there's one gentleman, uh, Mr. Bugarski, he know exactly uh, Hisense, that's, that's great. 
uh, and I, I expect uh, that uh, we all should know those brands beside of the Japanese and the Korean brands uh, which are already in top of the market. So Chinese goods are already have a very good uh, quality uh, product, what we don't know uh, yet, but we buy uh, these goods uh, in the shops. Uh, also, um, the lady following me will go in to do a short presentation about Econ Electric, the lighting industry company, and uh, NVC, a well-known well brand in China, is also going to uh, establish its uh, European uh, sales basis here in our building uh, very soon. Next, please. Here you can see also some of the uh, events, uh, how we are uh, generating and, uh, and uh, providing um, the services, showrooms uh, also over there, and also uh, big events uh, provided uh, for, for marketing activities. Because if you have a big voice, then you can, you can reach your potential customers. If you don't doesn't have a good voice and a good quality of the, of the communication, then maybe you miss your potential customers. Next, please. Logistic services. I uh, just uh, want to come back uh, to this point, because it's once uh, companies uh, establish uh, their ties uh, of the cooperation in uh, Central Europe, uh, and starting trade, the next big question is how the goods will arrive how they achieve uh, the uh, potential customers. And in the pictures, uh, you can see uh, within 24 hours uh, 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 circles how we can reach uh, our potential customers. For these reasons, the Central European Trade and Logistics Zone, we established uh, a logistics tie uh, and logistics hub in, the, in Budapest. And from here, within 24 hours, we can reach the, the central uh, circle, you can see. And um, also uh, from uh, last year uh, and also beginning from this year, we are also active in the, in the port of Bremen in Germany. And you can see the upper circle, which would uh, also cover uh, part of uh, uh, the Western uh, countries as well. So we are not only active in Central Europe, but we provide a whole supply chain uh, from the port to the Central Europe and then from Central Europe to reach the whole uh, region uh, and uh, also uh, the countries uh, nearby. In the upper picture, you can see uh, our Budapest uh, Logistics Center. In the lower picture, uh, sorry, still in Budapest. And in the lower picture, you can see our Germany uh, uh, warehouses where we can uh, welcome uh, goods not only from China but also from Hungary and from Serbia and any other countries if they go towards uh, to China. Next picture, please. Uh, in China, we have also wide distribution uh, network, so the, the trade uh, is not only one direction, not only from China to Central Europe, but also uh, uh, the China, China is looking for European goods uh, to, be, uh, to be sold in the market. Uh, also, these kind of logistics uh, channels can go vice versa uh, from China to EU and from EU to, to China. Next, please. Um, I would like to uh, call your attention to our exhibitions, uh, also uh, arranged uh, with the strong support uh, of China and from the Shandong province, because uh, it is uh, located in uh, Lingyi city. So we would like to welcome and to offer the opportunity also to uh, any other Central European countries, including uh, uh, Serbia, Croatia, Slovenia, Austria, Slovakia, uh, Romania, all the possibilities to exhibit in the Lingyi uh, Fair. Lingyi is a wholesale city in, uh, in Shandong, it's very famous locally and uh, we can see that there are opportunities open for showing your products. So you can exhibit over there and I think uh, we have uh, very good opportunities over there so we would like to call your attention to that and uh, also to come with us, not only showing Hungarian products, but also the wide range of products from uh, neighbor countries. Next, please. So, uh, just uh, for a short summary, because I don't want to go into very deep uh, details, uh, let me call your attention uh, to all services again. 
we are growing very quick uh, to, the, uh, to the trade and logistics uh, development in Central Europe. Currently, uh, we are uh, providing a full uh, portfolio uh, management. If there is an, uh, an opportunity, we would like to be a partner. We are not doing a consultancy, but we are doing a full partnership and also uh, including all kinds of services from finance to logistics, full distribution and, in and including all kinds of uh, necessary uh, support. So please call us. Uh, and also take participation uh, in uh, our activities and we would like to be happy to uh, support both Chinese and both Central European uh, companies to cooperate together and to bring you as many examples uh, as we can. So thank you very much for the attention, thank you very much for coming here and I wish to the event uh, a very good uh, success. And I really do hope that uh, uh, with all common uh, force, we will have uh, a success here in Central Europe. Thank you very much, and you can see now an example how it has been done.